Well, guys, I just had a pajama party. 11.30 at night. Don't know what Winnie was doing up, but she started it all. Tell me she saw a bag that she couldn't get out of her mind. And what did I do? I went and scrolled. Yes, I went and scrolled. And what did I find? I found the bag that I wanted. Of course, my email told me that Saks had the soft tabby on sale for $195. So I ran over, added to cart, and there she was. So I told Winnie that I went ahead and bought it. And then I texted and made sure that Autumn saw the message because she wanted one too. So I don't know if she bought it or not. She said she was going to sleep on it. So we'll, we'll see what happens. But I found out later that there was 10% cash back on Rakuten. And the bag that I've been eyeing for about a year was available on sale and then 10% cash back. What can I say, guys? I bought it. I'm not going to lie. I bought it. Now, let's see. Might just be a dream. Maybe I didn't buy it. But I know Eva was looking at some bags, too. Eva from Fuchsia Floyd. And I know last I checked, she was also scrolling. So if you want to see if Winnie or if Eva bought anything... You're going to have to check out their channel and see. In the meantime, I think I'm going to have to go to sleep. Dream about Coach. Got my buddy over here. Say hi, Tiggy. There's the little buddy. He's all cozied up. Thanks to James Jam for making me these gorgeous pillowcases, which I do remove before I go to sleep, but they're just so pretty. And they look so nice in my room. I love it. All right, guys. I'm going to wait for these packages to come in. And if I get packages, it means it wasn't all a dream. See you soon. Hello, everyone. Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. What can I say, guys? It was some late night coach shenanigans. And I got two coach bags out of it. When you finish watching me, head on over to Winnie BLV and to Fuchsia Floyd and check and see what they got because they were involved in some shenanigans too. So let's get on to the reveal. And unfortunately, it's a reveal because I deleted my actual unboxing. So hang on. Let me move the camera back a little tiny bit too. So let's get on with the first bag. So I got an email from Saks, and the email said that this bag was on sale. So let's check it out. I couldn't read this, guys. It was such a good price. $1.95. Can you imagine? I couldn't. And I said, you know, self, you're stupid if you don't buy this. So, you know, and then after everybody else buying something, I couldn't be left out. So here it is, guys. It's the Soft Tabby in Army Green. Let's do a little ABS. The straps are all inside. So I did already unbox this, and I accidentally deleted the video, guys. That's what you get when you do things late at night. But that's okay. We're going we're gonna to go on with it. Original retail on this was $450. This is snakeskin. And the trim, I, yes, the trim is snakeskin. I wasn't really sure if this was just an embossed leather, but this trim is snakeskin. The leather is super, super soft. This feels like suede on the reverse side. Smells like leather on the inside. And it comes with two straps. The short strap... Now, this is not snake. I don't think that this is a snake trim. This to me looks just like it's a dyed leather. It doesn't, I don't feel any scales and I don't see any scales. So this is actually 
just leather. Leather, leather that's been treated to look like snake skin. I'm going to have to ask a coach just to be sure. So I still have some padding on here. Let's remove the rest of it. And I unfortunately didn't bring my knife over here to cut off the tag. So we're just going to bear with it. And guys, this is still a pajama party. I'm having a lazy Saturday. I got my Barefoot Dreams Moo on and a Barefoot Dreams sweater. So I'm just hanging out in my pajamas and sharing all this with you guys. So I'm going to attach the short strap so you can see what it looks like with the short strap. I'm not going to do any mod shots because the sweater is really, really thick and it's not going to give you the best idea of what this looks like with an outfit. So let's take this off so that we can really get a better look at what she's like. Totally undressed. And like I said, I can't take the tag off right now, but check it out. Here's the short strap and I'm just going to show you over my shoulder. Here's what it looks like shoulder. It's a perfect drop. It does fit over this thick sweater. So no problem there. If you wanted to wear it with a jacket or a coat, it's going to work out fine. And then it comes with the long crossbody strap, which I haven't taken all the packaging off of. Let me try to do that now. It's a two piece strap. And it's adjustable. Normally coach bags have a very long crossbody drop. So pretty much, pretty much anyone can wear it. Now, here's just one little issue when I took the packaging off. The strap keeper dropped off because it's not attached to the bag itself. So I'm just going to get this, slide it on, and there, it's not going anywhere now. And I really don't think that this is gonna come loose once you have everything connected. So let me put the buckle completely through. All of the holes have metal, so this isn't gonna fray. And here's what it looks like. It's gunmetal hardware, and it's got the coach markings on the hardware and also on the buckle. And the strap is really pretty. I like to wear this sometimes with a double strap. You can put a chain decoration on here. You can pretty much do whatever you'd like to do if you wanna dress up the bag. I tend to just kind of use a bag charm and leave things as is. So, here it is with the long crossbody, and I'm just going to, I will stand up for a second and hopefully give you an idea, but you know, remember, I'm not really in an outfit, so move this back a bit, and you can see it's a perfect length for me crossbody, so yeah, let's get the girls out of the frame here. <laughs> So, awesome bag. I'm so happy that I got it. Got a zip pocket in the back. And the inside of the pocket is lined with fabric. And it feels like a really nice jacquard fabric. I love how smushy this leather is. And, oops, am I having problems with the zipper here? No, just was grabbing it wrong. So the bottom and the sides are a little bit more structured. So it's gonna keep its shape in general, but it's gonna be nice and slouchy otherwise. You can see how nice and squishy this is. I don't like bag organizers. I think the bag organizers really take away from the look of the bag because this is not supposed to be structured. So. I love how it looks. I do still have a little bit of stuffing inside, but you can see this is one compartment. This back wall is lined with suede. This is fabric lined, and then there's a zip pocket here along the front wall. And it's a pretty long zip pocket, so if you want to keep anything here that's going to be 
separated from the rest of the bag. You know, if you need to get your, your ID card or your wallet or anything in a hurry, you could do it with no problem. So it's great for that. And the magnet is nice and strong. It finds its way. Watch this. You don't really have to do anything much to it. It's closed. So there's no issue with opening and closing this bag. And I'm going to just adjust my camera a wee bit. There we go. Because I'm in a, in a kind of weird spot. So this second bag that I have, guys, it's spectacular. It is just spectacular. Wait until you see. Here it is in its box. A dust bag. And... I was waiting for over a year for this bag to go on sale. Let me just tell you. And when I found out that it did go on sale and there was cash back on Rakuten, I snapped it up. I couldn't help it. What was I to do? Could I pass this up? No, I couldn't pass it up. I had to add it to cart. So I paid under $500, which I think was great because it was originally $7.95. So does that give you any idea of what this bag is? Tigs, you know. Yes, it's the Quilted Studio Bag in Carnation Pink. <gasps> Feast your eyes on this. Oh, look at this beauty. Oh my God. I'm so excited. Look, it even matches this sweater. Oh, geez. So this is Napa leather. I haven't taken the wrapping off of the clochette. And I don't know how many people know this, but Yoda and I found this out when we went to coach. The SA, who was just incredible, told us that the lock on the studio bags is actually functional. So the key that's in the clochette fits in the lock and you can take your bag and lock it which is great if you're going to be in a crowd or if you're going to be anywhere where you're afraid that your bag is going to come open accidentally for travel or whatnot sorry for my hair guys I have nothing on my face by the way except for skincare a little mascara and some lip balm and a tiny bit of under eye concealer because I got hereditary dark circles what could I say but anyway back to the bag so this is actually a functioning lock. And let's do a little ABS. I haven't got the tags off yet. And that's only because when I unbox these, I wanted to wait to take the rest of the wrapping off of it. And I didn't really have time because I filmed the video kind of late. And I accidentally deleted it. But we're gonna carry on. Okay, there's the bottom, the sides, and this bag has compartments. So I'm gonna give it an open. And of course, there's something very special, very, very special. It comes with two shoulder straps. It comes with a pink crossbody strap. And this is a more narrow strap than what comes with the soft tabby. So let me finish connecting this. Okay, I'll put that through. So I have another piece of plastic to get off. Because you know with Coach, they wrap everything so well. Okay, so forgive the wrapping here. This is all gunmetal hardware. Same as what comes on this soft tabby, so it's the same color. And this also comes with the long leather wrapped shoulder strap. And guys, this is gorgeous. It's a really long strap. It's perfect for crossbody and it's really exquisite. Really, really exquisite. I'm going to bring this up close so you can get a look and see what the links look like. And each link is stitched. And here is 
the hardware. And it's just magnificent. Absolutely magnificent. So let's get into the bag itself. It's Napa leather. It feels so incredibly soft. So, so gorgeous. I mean, this is just fabulous, fabulous leather. I, I don't know what to say. And it's all leather. The inside of the flap is leather. There's a back pocket here, a very narrow slip pocket that you can put maybe papers or receipts or something that you want to separate. There's another little patch slip pocket here. And the back of this patch slip pocket is fabric, but the front of it is leather. And here's a little care booklet. Put that back. And then you have a big main compartment, again, all leather, and then a front compartment. And all leather. I mean, this is an all leather bag. And when I first opened it, I said, wow, this is really heavy. I didn't realize that this was all leather. Here's the inside of the clasp. And of course, this fits in this way. And there you go. This bag is magnificent. I mean, it's just absolutely magnificent. It's so classic. Just beautiful. I mean, beautiful. This is, this is one of the prettiest bags that I've ever seen. Here's the hang tag. And I mean, what can I say? It's, it's just glorious. Oh, guys, I'm in love. I am in love. This is why it pays to stay up sometimes and scroll late at night because you get deals like this. So thank you all for watching. I will come back, of course, in a little bit, couple of weeks and do a review on these and let you know what fits, what I think about it, and give a little bit more in-depth detail. Thank you always for watching. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell and watch out because I'm going to see you in my next video. Have a great day. Watch Winnie and watch Eva. Thank you both so much for doing this collab with me. Bye-bye.